What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the Georgia Bassmaster channel. Today I am currently waiting on my dad to get here. We're about to load in the boat, but about four or five days ago, I stumbled across about an eight or nine pound bass spawning. I'm not gonna give the location, but there was like an eight or nine spawning and about 20 feet away, there was like a six pounder that was spawning. So hopefully those bass are still on bed because they could have already done their thing and left because it's getting pretty late in the spawn and uh, a big rain came in, muddied up the water. I'm thinking that today the water might be clear enough to actually put these polarized glasses on and sight fish these bass. So if you guys are new to the channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button. Go to pinesideperformance.com or I'll leave a link in the description. Use code Georgia, save you 15% off your purchase. That's where I got the shirt, the hat, pretty good stuff. So make sure you support those guys. Small business, but doing great things in the fishing industry. But we're gonna get down here. I have a, I have uh, some stick worms, other things, some bed fish baits I'm gonna be using today. So let's see if we can get some big fish. I have a pretty good feeling it's gonna be a good day. So without further ado, I'll see you guys out on the lake. Peace. It sure does look like a light spot, right? Could just be a spot where the grass ain't growing, but it could be a big old bed. Nope. It's a bed. Right out of that hole. Oh, get him. Yeah, he's beat up a little bit, man. I'm telling you, that came out of that bed right where you threw it over. I said that looks like a bed right there. We'll blam. Mm -hmm. No, he's beat up. See that? Yeah, I wonder hit, if that's hit on the side. That's probably the male, I think, if it's beat up like that. See it? Fan yeah. tail marks. Yeah. It's a pretty good one. Right out of that bed. There's another bed right here. I don't want to spook it away. We just landed almost on top of the bed. It might come out. I saw that bed out there. Yeah, I think there's a bass in that bed. Hello there. You see that bed? Yeah. Right there. Oh, I saw a flash down in there. That's all I did on that one. I saw that little light spot. She's beat up on the side too. I'm telling you, it's been somewhere. I knew they were there. There's beds. I just don't think there's as many of them. Not a bad one. Bye. That one. I'm a dirt bait. A little bitty bass, but probably ten throws with a jerk bait. They can't they can't resist these things. Like look at this thing. Look at all the splash on that. Oh yeah. Oh good. jerk bait. Old jerk bait got him again. Yep. Might should have been throwing this all day. Maybe should have. I'll get him. Nice. 
I just love them shining jerk baits out here in the sun. Not a bad one. Oh, I haven't weighed it, I'm just letting it go. It's a large mouth. Currently on the spot number two where I saw the big ones at the other day, so I see there's already been somebody fishing back here, so hopefully they ain't caught all the fish. I don't know how it goes. They probably done fished over those bass and not even realized that there was an eight pounder sitting down there. <clears throat> but it's been pretty successful so far. Seen some big bedding bass. Saw some five or sixes. Couldn't get them to bite though. They weren't locked down on a bed yet. They were just more cruising. So on the way to the good spot right now. Sun's directly above us. Should have plenty of time to sight fish. And we'll see you guys over there. That's a fish. Yes, sir. Gotta be a spot. Yep. No, nope, large mouth. Looks just like a spot there for a second. Yeah, it did. I thought it was. There we go. Ooh, right there where I hit, that's where you hung a big one last year. Yeah, hey. They spawn right there. On a flick shake, too. On a flick shake. Oh, it snapped me off. Oh, man. Did Boy, it was pulling. Again this year. Dag gum it. I was probably horsing him a little bit more than I should have been. I was trying to get it away from that stick, though. Yeah. Oh, I had that bass again. <laughs> yeah, I, I've already caught her once. I was sitting there thinking, felt like a bite. That's a fish. Uh oh, we doubled up. They fighting. I don't know, man. I don't know. You got about a four or five on that yours. Whoa, you sure? Yeah. Dude, he's got the fight on him, man. Dude. We both caught a good one in this cove. Ah. <laughs> All right, you got the bigger one. And I got a three and a half. That's what I'm talking about. There's oh. some fish up in this cove. That we got doubled up with big ones. Oh, old largemouth spawner cove. That's a picture worthy one for sure. I'd probably put her back. All right, we done doubled up on some good ones. We're gonna go ahead and get a release on them real quick. That's probably six pounder. 
I'm gonna let her go Let's back go. to the bed. Man. Doubled up, two at the same time. That's one of those moments where we had to decide uh, which one was worth netting. <laughs> I had to, I was fighting my fish and netting yours at the same time. All right guys, just doubled up. Ended up having to net my dad's fish while I had my fish on the line. So we were both catching a fish at the same time and his was like a six pounder. So I had to decide that his was worth netting and mine was worth just playing with. So we both got it on a wacky rigged uh, flick shape. Wacky worm, whatever you want to call it. And uh, it's probably about 6.30, it's almost dark. And uh, on those spawning bass, we didn't actually see those fish's beds, but we were over here about a week ago and saw where these fish were bedding. So we ended up coming back and actually getting on them. So I think we got one more spot. I know where another six pounder has been bedding. So we're gonna head over there. Make sure you leave a like on this video for that big bass. So we'll see you guys at the next spot. I think I got one. It ain't real big, I just think it's a big spot. It's a good spot. I mean, when they running like that, She a football, look at her. Yeah, man. Oh, fat girl. Miniature fo football. Put her in a live well. All right, the sun is currently setting. I think we're gonna call it a day. There's like a bazillion people at the boat ramp. My goodness, you see all them people? There's like four boats so down there. Somebody trying to back up a trailer. Anyways. I think we're gonna be here for a while, but I have work tomorrow because it is a Sunday currently. Yeah, the uh, Carl's Bait and Tackle Waggle Worm was what I caught most of my spotted bass and uh, most of the fish on. And I caught the other fish off the Guggen Squad Clutch Jerk Bait, the four to six foot deep runner. Uh, I'll show you the color of that thing right now. It's just like a silver. It has a flash out here in the daytime, so make sure if you haven't already got you a Carl's Bait and Tackle membership. Link will be in the description below. Get these baits, they save 30% off everything. So if you guys are not already subscribed, make sure you do that. And uh, I should have some, some more Florida videos coming for you pretty soon. So be on the lookout for that. See you guys later, peace.